What's going on? Welcome to EndNews.com. It's your host, EJ Carrion. Today, we're going to talk about a public service loan program, the public service loan program that's out to support um, people who do professions like teaching, firefighting. In 2007, a public service loan forgiveness program was launched to make those careers more attractive and, and provide loan forgiveness for people who, who spent years in those professions. Now, um, it was difficult to take advantage of that program, but the Biden administration the last three months made it easier. And yesterday, the Biden administration said um, that they were projecting 22,000 people to get their loans forgiven, wiped out, but they actually have already um, wiped out 70,000 uh, public service professionals uh, loans. Pretty cool stuff. And get this, based off the article, you're looking at 550,000 more people available um, and, and they're making it easier to apply and get benefits of this loan program. And I think that's super cool. Let's go ahead and get to the article. <laughs> All right, so student loan forgiveness has arrived for 70,000 borrowers working public service jobs. Here's the part that I wanted to get us to. The Biden administration estimates as many as 550,000 borrowers could benefit from these changes to the program. Those who have worked for a decade in public service should be able to rely on the public service loan forgiveness program. But until October, the system haven't delivered on the promise, said James Caval, undersecretary of the Department of Education. There's going to be probably a lot of excitement around this. And to me, this is a pivotal moment where people become more comfortable with loan forgiveness. Uh, and we're starting with those who, who, who need it most. And those are who went to go get college degrees to do jobs um, that matter and uh, but weren't getting compensated for. And so if you were a young person, 18, 20 years old, deciding to do be a teacher or be a firefighter, expecting to get your loans forgiven, now this seems a little bit more real. And so really excited to kind of see where this goes. And this is a win for the Biden administration.